So we are going to speak about repurposed garbage bags. So we had a big song that came out earlier this year about packing your clothes in a garbage bag, but you are repurposing garbage bags in a different way. So tell me about yes. it. So basically the product is titled after my mom, Rose. It was created as a dedication to her. And in dedicating the product to her, we built a story that is aligned to what she represented while she was alive. She was a giver, first and foremost. She was a hard worker, and um, she brought up five kids alone, wow. and she was very much um, influential in shaping our values as and, individuals. And that in itself, like you said, she brought up five kids on her own. That is no easy task. That is a, a mammoth task, you know, so definitely yes, um, it was. values and, and, and stuff, uh, you know, it, it shows her, her gumption. Yes, it does. And the product in itself strongly represents this as each of the colors, pink, purple, red, and blue, represents various uh, causes. So at the end of, of our physical financial year, we intend to give back to these causes and also create a cultural and social positive um, awareness around cultural and social change. So tell me so about this the... Is the, you said they were color-coded for the um, different projects. Tell us about the projects. The colors represent a cause. So the pink is aligned to cancer. The purple is aligned to Alzheimer's. The blue is aligned to water conservation. And the red is aligned to HIV and AIDS. So the consumer becomes part of a broader conversation that gives back to, you know, their communities. All right, well, um, it seems that this is an excellent initiative. So you're doing this, um, you know, in the, as the legacy of, of your mom, what she has left behind. Yes, we are. And in addition to this, we intend to um, tie in the destination Tobago and within our marketing, promote the island as an even, you know, more green, serene destination that has adapted the product, um, supports the product via the Tobago House of Assembly, who is extremely excited of the possibilities. Um, we have also aligned to Penny Savers in Tobago. Mr. Mm -hmm. Warner has, Kurt Warner has been very instrumental in, you know, helping us um, push the product forward. We also have brands such as Massey out of Trinidad and Unipet who would also be our flagship bearers for the brand. And they would also be playing an active role in the social activities and the cultural change that we would like to impact throughout not just Trinidad and Tobago, but the Caribbean. The technology that we are utilizing uh, with the bags, we have acquired the sole distribution license for the Caribbean region. So as the brand develops momentum, we intend to, you know, take it to other Caribbean islands and um, impact that cultural change and eco-consciousness. Eco All right. So um, the thing is that you're doing is repurposing garbage bags. So where do you acquire the original product from and how do you go about repurposing them? Well, the original product comes from Canada the raw materials, and it is manufactured in Asia for now. Uh, we have all intentions of setting up a plant, a manufacturing plant, to start locally manufacturing the product. And once the product is disposed of or it becomes um, to the end of its life cycle, it naturally degrades in the environment to CO2, biomass, and hummus, as we would say. Okay, so, uh, so it what becomes, material are the bags made out of? The bags know. are made of uh, an element of plastic, an element of organic material, and an, an accelerant that has been embraced throughout Canada, throughout the United Arab Emirates, and some parts of the African continent. Uh, via their legislation, the Uni United Arab Emirates uh, imposed that this product be the only, or this technology, I should say, is the only technology that would be used within their region as mm. it relates to plastic and treating with plastic waste. All right, that sounds very interesting.
So, Alicia Riley, thank you for all you've shared this morning. Um, you know, it's definitely an interesting and very um, positive initiative you're moving forward there with there um, in the remembrance um, and legacy of your mom. You know, so I want to say congratulations for all that you're doing. And, you know, just looking forward to the best from you and your, your way forward. Thank you very much. And right. thank you for having us. Of course. And have a great morning. Thank you.